I'm sure we can all agree that installing NixOS is very easy. The Calamaris installer included by default is well known among Linux users and does a pretty good job of abstracting the basic installation process. However, when you delve deeper into the NixOS ecosystem, you may find yourself wanting to have something a bit more personalized, like an installation media bundled with your favorite commands, your custom documentation, or even your entire customized environment. And so today, we are going to learn how to build your very own NixOS installer ISO image. I will showcase both flakes and non-flakes methods today, so feel free to skip parts of the video that are irrelevant to your setup. To begin declaring it, we want to create a new configuration. If you are using flakes, you can define a new configuration alongside your existing ones and import a new empty configuration.nix module inside. You can call it however you want, but make sure to remember its name, as we will need it in a moment. Create a new configuration.nix file at the reference location and fill it with basic module boilerplate. Now we want to include modules path in the parameter set at the top, and we are finally ready to import the installation CD module. It will do all of the heavy lifting for us, so we can focus on personalizing our installer. Flakes require us to be super explicit about everything, so we also need to set the host platform here. We are going to include more options later, but for now, to build the ISO image, we can use this command right here. Make sure that the part that comes after NixOS configurations is set to your configuration name, wait for the command to finish, and you will see a result directory with your ISO image appear in your current working directory. You can also use this alternative NixOS generators command right here, it comes with the benefit of being able to choose the image format and even cross-compile to other architectures with some additional setup. Now in case you're not using Flakes yet, create a new configuration.nix file anywhere you want and fill it with module boilerplate. Include modules path at the top and import the installation CD module. Then use one of these two commands and don't forget to reference your configuration.nix file here or here. And just like with the flakes method, the result with your ISO image will be symlinked into your current working directory. You can use this ISO image straight away, and in its current state, it closely resembles the minimal image available on the official NixOS installation page. Let's go back to the configuration and tweak it a bit more. Here we can include anything you want, including various programs, desktop environments, custom modules, or even your entire desktop configuration. For now, let's simply add some useful utilities you may need during NixOS installation, enable Flakes to save you some time later, and throw in your favorite desktop environment or window manager. After building the image and loading it into a VM, we can see that everything works just as expected. The installation CD module comes with an auto-login user named NixOS, so after booting the system, we can immediately utilize this image to install NixOS or recover any damaged system with your preferred tools. Before I finish this video, I'd like to thank everybody who subscribed to the channel, because today's the day we finally hit a 10,000 subscribers mark. This is pretty crazy, but what's even crazier is that we also hit a 1,000 members mark on our Discord server at roughly the same time. It's wild to think that all of this happened in just 8 months, but this surely is just the beginning. And now, I would like to thank the sponsors of this video, specifically... Hoskins, p Easy, Aiding Bad Ponder, Z, Not A Nut, Uni... Xavier, Albert C, Pit3M, Tibalt Mall, Shen, Workflow, Attila, Bradley Davis, Z once again, Urban Zen, Uncle Simon, Slim5782, Chaiberg, Liam Creamers, Shigenori Suzuki, and Anonymous Donations. As usual, don't forget to check out our Discord server, leave a like or a comment if you enjoyed this video, or subscribe if you're feeling extra generous. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.